Hello, and welcome to Physics 1, Experiment 2, Local Freefall Acceleration. For this experiment, we will be collecting data to calculate the specific gravity for our area. We know the average gravity for Earth is 9.82 meters per second squared, and we will use this to check our findings. Here is what you will need. The LXI data logger, the freefall apparatus, the digital adapter, a metal ball, as well as a 2 meter stick. Here's how the freefall apparatus works. The freefall apparatus consists of two different portions. Initially, we have the ball holder portion, which is used to secure the ball in place and works as a start timer. Next, we have the paddle portion, which acts as a stop timer whenever the ball makes impact. We will now demonstrate how to secure the ball in the holder. Initially, we want to loosen the thumb screw located on the left side of the holder. We will notice a metal rod that will be able to move back and forth. We want to place the ball on the metal contact on the holder and then press down on the rod firmly. We will then tighten the thumb screw and the ball should be held in place. To release the ball, we will loosen the thumb screw and the ball will fall onto the pedal. Now we will set up for procedure A. For procedure A, we want the ball holder to be at a height of 1.5 meters above the pedal. To do this, we will loosen up the set screw on the mounting hardware and adjust the ball holder so that the bottom of the metal sheet is at the 150 centimeter mark. Now you want to test that the ball will hit the pedal each time, so we will do a test run to make sure that the ball has good contact with the pedal. Once we have a good pedal position, we are now ready to begin procedure A. Procedure A consists of dropping the ball from the 1.5 meter height a multitude of times. Please refer to the LXI video for setup questions. We will be using four digits of accuracy for this lab. Once the ball is secured in the holder, we will press start on the LXI and then release the ball. Once the ball makes contact, our time should appear and we will press stop on the LXI. Once we have recorded our data, we will reset the experiment, press start on the LXI again, and collect more data. We will repeat this process until we have the required number of data points. Now we are ready to move on to procedure B. For procedure B, we will be adjusting the height of the ball holder. Again, to do this, we will loosen the set screw on the mounting hardware and adjust the height of the ball holder. We want to vary the height by at least 10 centimeters each time. The procedure for dropping the ball and collecting data is the same as procedure A. 
be sure to make use of the full length of the rod that the ball holder is mounted to to ensure accurate data. Once we have collected all the relevant data, we can use the equations in the lab manual to complete the lab. Thank you for watching and feel free to refer to this video at any time.